So if you want to buy cryptocurrency using Apple Pay, then you need to find a reputable exchange or marketplace that will let you do that. Fortunately, I'm going to be going over three of them. And then right after that, I'm going to be recommending seven altcoins I believe will do good long term. Okay, let's start things off with Coinbase. Now, what else can I say about Coinbase? They've been around forever. I've been using them for seven or eight years. I've got 40,000 in my account, plus they've got over 100 plus coins. And yes, they allow you to use Apple Pay. Okay, next up, we've got Uphold. Now, Uphold is a really cool crypto exchange because they've got staking rewards where you can earn some passive income, stocks, and some other cool things as well. Okay, and then last up, if you wanted to use Apple Pay to buy some crypto, you could do that here on BlockFi. Now, BlockFi is basically in earnings cryptocurrency saving app i guess you could say but it's just another staking platform and it's awesome okay now that i've covered these three different crypto exchanges that allow you to use apple pay let's go over some of the top cryptos i want to take a look at Okay, also as I'm getting into these coins, if you're looking for some great crypto exchanges to get started with, we'll have some bonus and resource links in the description. Okay, I do want to start things off with Crypto.com, aka CRO, aka Kronos, whatever you want to call it. They renamed it. Um, and I've talked about this coin quite a bit because honestly, I feel like it's safe. You know, right now it's at 18 cents. It's got a 9.6 billion market cap. Realistically, I think this is a 100 billion market cap cryptocurrency in the next, you know, who knows, one, two, three years. Uh, the reason for that is because it's an exchange coin. If we look at the Binance coin, that's done some tremendous things. Crypto.com is the fastest growing crypto exchange in the world. And yeah, it hurts. I mean, you know, all the coins I'm going to be going over because Bitcoin has gone down. You know, everything has suffered. You know, Crypto.com CRO was literally at like 40 something cents a month ago. And, you know, it's just gotten hammered. Okay, next up, we've got the engine coin. ENJ. Now, I love this coin. I've been actually buying more of it. I was saying for a while, really anything under two or three bucks was a good buy on this. And now we're at 65 cents with a 580 million market cap. Now, I think this is a long term winner for a couple of reasons. They've been around for a long time. They were, you know, pioneering the NFTs with marketplaces. They started off as a gaming community. Um, Honestly, the partnerships are strong. They started a $100 million NFT fund. They're not going anywhere. And that's really the point here. You know, Engine is not going anywhere. And you want to be in these projects that have that long-term potential. And I definitely believe Engine does. So really, right now, under a dollar is just a steal. So I would definitely be stacking some Eng. Okay, next up, we've got Stellar. Uh, currently at, geez, 12 cents with a 3.1 billion market cap. Another coin that has gotten hammered. Uh, I was saying for a while on this one, anything under 30 cents is a really good buy. Uh, and I do believe that. Um, this coin has yet to break its all-time highs from, you know, whatever, a few years ago. It got up to like 90 cents. Stellar has a strong correlation with XRP. It's for, you know, banks, but it's also for individual users. It's been a top 30, top 50 coin for a long time, and it's really not going anywhere. So Stellar is just one of those coins that it's got that staying power, right? They've also got strong partnerships. Um, really anything under 30 cents on this, as long as you're averaging into it, I think is a really good buy. Um, so yeah. Okay, next up, let's take a look at uh, Decentraland. Wow, Decentraland, you know, I love the project, uh, but, you know, no denying that it's also taken a big hit. Currently, it's at around a dollar with a 1.8 billion market cap. Now, this coin has been leading the metaverse cryptos, you know, for good reason. Uh, they've got a marketplace that sells virtual goods and virtual real estate. And, you know, the virtual real estate aspect of everything is pretty insane. And the fact that people are actually, you know, buying and selling it on their marketplace is just wild. Now, Atari is a big investor in them. They've got some other, you know, big partnerships. Um, my average on this coin was 70 cents. And it's crazy to see that it's getting to that point again when this coin had an all time high of around like $5.50 at one point in the last 12 months. So it's definitely taken a big hit. Like I said, Bitcoin is the reason for all of this. But, you know, when things turn around, uh, you know, this one, I think you should definitely have it in your crypto portfolio long term. Uh, I think you'll definitely be happy with the outcome. Okay, next up, we've got XR Pay. Okay, XRP, what else can I say about it? It is my biggest crypto holding, over 200K coins in total. It's down to about 40 cents, 19 billion market cap. You know, it's impossible for anybody to predict the future, but 
XRP out of all the coins out there, you know, they're trying to basically change the way money is exchanged, uh, you know, across the world. Um, and if they do what they're trying to do and they are doing in the background right now with all the partnerships, you know, this coin, honestly, uh, if we look back at it years from now, anything under a dollar on it, people are going to be like, man, I wish I bought some XRP. So the risk to reward on XRP is just so massive. You know, you should definitely own some of it. I think a minimum of 10,000 coins, honestly, you know, uh, if you can afford it, um, obviously 100,000 would probably be the better number if you're trying to become a millionaire sooner than later on it. But, you know, if you can afford 10,000 of XRP right now, you know, I would definitely, uh, get some of it. Okay, next up, you got the base attention token currently sitting at 38 cents, 567 million market cap. Now, I think the multiple you could get on this coin is pretty big. This is an advertising coin connected with the Brave browser. It's just got a really strong use case. And, you know, once again, you want to be in these projects that not only have staying power, but the projects are sound, you know, they've got growth behind them. And that is, you know, kind of what you're going to get here. Uh, the BAT token's been around since 2017. Um, and, you know, they've just been growing their user base. And those are the things you want to see. You know, I think this coin could easily, you know, especially the multiple on it now at this, you know, a 20x is very possible on this coin. I, I just, I can see it. 10x minimum, 20x possible. Okay, last up, we've got Polkadot. I like Polkadot for a few reasons. It's a software cryptocurrency. It's basically an alternative to Ethereum. Uh, it's at $9 right now with a $4.6 billion market cap. Once again, another coin that has gotten hammered. I think this coin was at like $40 to $50 not too long ago. But if you don't own a lot of Ethereum, you might want to take a look at Polkadot. Uh, I think you're, you're going to get much better growth out of this coin in the, you know, the coming years than you are with Ethereum, especially on the multiple. Plus, you know, uh, it's a sound project as well. If you look into it a little bit, you could see that... Um, yeah, I mean, uh, they're doing things behind the scenes. Okay, anyways, to wrap this all up and bring it home for you guys, you know, these are, in my opinion, seven super legit altcoins to hold for the next five to 10 years. Um, and, you know, with the way the crypto market has been going lately, you definitely want to have a long term mindset on things because honestly, you know, you can trade in the short term, but long term, sometimes if you just sit and hold and you're patient, you know, you're going to be rewarded for that patience. Okay, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this one. Thanks for watching it. We'll see you in the next crypto video.